that doesn't need any other intro than this huge silence. Rock that. And uh, this is Jacques. This is Ch -ch 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 Chips 3. Let's go. Let's go. There's 9.99, but at the same time, there's a tease there. And for some reason, my counter is still going crazy. Are these doubled? I don't want to take the risk. Yes, they are. Okay, I need to cope with the fact that there's Mr. Dinosaur Guy there who wants to eat a bit of my brain. And, um... You really put all the chips to be gone? Really? Again? That would be insane. This time I'm gonna try to be around the exit by the time I reach zero. Legend zero on the, the counter just to see if there's a glitch that allows me to exit um, before having the legend zero. You know, before having to reset the count the the thing you know, the counter and have to collect all the those freaking chips in the level because else it would be a very very boring video for you guys and also for me and I won't have anything to talk about bef because I'd be fucking pissed so as I'm saying that how was your day mine was horrible thanks uh, no no that's not true but I don't have any particular topic to uh, talk about today so Kind of, oh well, I'll, I'll talk about something, I guess. It's CC related, so you, you guys will like that. So I'm basically a staff member uh, on, on the new board created by Tom P, CC Zone. Go check it out, the link, um, cczone.envision.com, I think, it's something like that. Um, yeah, and... I created this um, a competition, a new competition. Well, Tom had the idea for the new competition, and I created a level for it. So you should go over there, um, participate with the community if you haven't yet, or something like that, and try to compete in that level. Basically, the goal of this level, and ironically enough, this kind of level that I'm playing right now would be appropriate for it. You have to collect the most amount of stuff possible in level before getting out you know you, you're not you're not titled to finish the level or finish the level in the, um, the least amount of time possible but what you're gonna do is collect the most amount of things and your score base is based on, upon the, um, the, the the number of items you have collected by then of course there's also a time factor but it's very minimal, it's something like a point for each 10 seconds, so it's very loose. So you should go over there and try the level that I submitted for that contest. I'm gonna be the, the judge since I'm a competition staff over there, something like that. And you can participate along with the community if you haven't uh, done that yet. Except if you're watching this video, you probably know about this and probably already participated in the community and now I have minus 85 chips to get for some reason so I should get out Sh can I? no I can't, okay um, let's collect chips around the exit so that I don't have to run accidentally into a chip when I reach legend zero let's try that so yeah I should go over there CC zone, the new CC zone for those who aren't familiar can I get out? No. Okay, now I have 90 to get. Let's try this. I hope I can manage to sort of glitch out of this level or something. Uh, so yeah, for those who are old enough to know about this, Jacques is one of these, actually, I think. Um, in the community, that by which I mean. Because even I knew about the original CC Zone. I was... Uh, I hope it works. I don't think it will because there's the zero is not yellow. Nah. Gah, gah, gah. This is a great level idea, man. 
Uh, don't don't submit that level anywhere, Jock. <laughs> seriously, <laughs> this ain't to be taken seriously. Yeah, um, but go over there, and there are, there's also other type of competitions, uh, the standard ones that were used by the original staff, member, the people over there. Like the time trial and the create competition, and there's I think there's already a create competition going on at the, the time. The theme is uh, optional volcanic theme with a uh, with multiple exits. That's actually a requirement uh, with multiple ways of solving the level. So yeah, go ahead and try your hand at it if you're interested, make the Kamiya live. I think it's actually a great um, idea for the community because it, it needed some of, of those, you know, and it needed life in some sort of way that does not involve a boring uh, Facebook chat. You know, it, it needs to be beyond that, you know what I mean there? So, as I'm kind of done promoting uh, the community there, <laughs> I'm gonna try to finish this level without um, leaving my head on the... Well, it's not even gonna be on the thing, you know? It's gonna be right in the fireplace, no strings attached with that. Uh, I will just throw my head head first, well hair first in the fireplace and then put torch wood or something like that and light it up and after that scream because my head for some reason is still connected to the brain and the brain is still alive and then oh yeah and the other day I went to the hospital because I wanted to see about um, recently, re recently dead people just to um, add to my eyeball correct collection and they didn't have any, so I had to uh, ask the nurse there, you know, about uh, potential deaths, you know, in the hospital. And they referred me to a guy named uh, Steve. And this guy apparently has very big eyes, you know, and so that, that it could easily fill a hole, you know, uh, a whole container, you know, with plasma and blood and everything you want in it, you know. It, it could fill an entire container while um, a normal container would contain way more than only these, you know. It, it contains, like, I'd say around 20 eyeballs. That's around what I got in my my container, you know. So, I went there, and they told me a guy named Steve was about to die out of um, cancer, I guess. I don't know, I don't remember. But, I'm kind of glad so that my eyeball collection will finally start growing up again, because I kind of slacked on that. Of course, for those who believe that, you are jerks. Uh, now that I'm done ranting about hospital murders, it's not really murder, it's more about people who die in the hospital. And everybody knows that they die because they eat too much jello. You know, it has to be because of that. Nobody eats jello outside hospitals, so they have to die because of jello. That's my conclusion there. They have to die because they ate too much jello. That's my only um, potential death cause. And then I could have their eyeballs soaked in jello. Mmm. And I could taste them. No, not really. But, meanwhile, I got two chips to find really where they are. Where are they? I don't have any single idea. Give me, give me those chips. Where are they? I am afraid. Someone is gonna get me, which is not you, Mr. Tease.
This one is named... I'm gonna try to find a name for you guy. What could be your name? I'm gonna try walk your pace a bit, have a little bit of conversation there. What be your name? Um, I guess I'll call you... Clyde. So Clyde, how is the day? Oh, sideswipe! Haha, <laughs> got you there! <laughs> Oh man, you can't catch me, Clyde. You are leashed. There's nothing you can do but dance with me. <laughs> that would have been ridiculously funny. <laughs> Imagine. Okay, Clyde, I gotta leave you there for a bit. Would you mind? No, no, get off screen. I don't want even to see your face again. Bye. I don't think I have time for another one, just saying, putting that there. I don't know, but I don't think I have time for another one. This idea was from Pie Guy. You know what? Oof. Really. This is Rock that's signing out. And... I think I'll get both Jacques and Pie Guy's eyeballs for dinner tonight. See y'all.